and we're not going to have the dawdle we had in the previous round. Gipcho leads, Harold Norpeth in second place, Odessil Czechoslovakia in third place, one of the Americans next then, Bodo Tumla, De Hoto, and Wagner at the moment about eighth place, and Ryan towards the back and right at the back, another of the Americans, now it's Bosberger of France, with Ryan having moved up a little bit, and Kip Kino coming through very quickly on the outside, won't want the pace to drop. Gipko really cutting it out for Kano. Harold Norpeth, the thin man from Germany in second place. Kip Kano moving easily third. Bodo Tumler is fourth. Odersil is fifth. In sixth place, Jodikowski of Poland. Seventh, Little De Herdog of Belgium. And eighth, John Wett. And there's now about 30 yards covering the field. And look at the pace. 55.9, about 56 seconds. Well inside a four-minute schedule. They're really sorting them out now, and the Kenyans trying to make the altitude tell and run the finish out of Jim Ryan. Gipcho leads for Kenya. In second place, Harold Norbert, West Germany. Third, Chip Kano of Kenya. Fourth, the European champion, Bodo Tumla of West Germany. Then a gap, Odersil, Czechoslovakia, dropping back. John Wetton moving up into fifth place, not letting the two Germans and the two Kenyans get away. Clearly, this is team running by the Kenyans. Designed to produce, produce a gold medal for Kano. Going back through the field, there's Jim Ryan back in about eighth place. 20 yards behind Kano, who hits the front now with two laps to go. And the Kenyans are really trying to make the height of 7,000 feet here in Mexico City tell on the world record holder. The pace near suicidal. Well inside a world record pace. 155.31, and if this goes on, the world record could go at altitude. There's now 40 yards between first and last. Kano, way in front, five, six yards there. Bodo Tumla, European champion, second. Harold Norpeth, third. John Wetton, fourth, and Ryan a long way back. Wetton running a magnificent race, he's going for medals, and Ryan having to really run to catch them now. He's 30 yards behind Kano, and he surely will never cut this back now if Kano can hold it. The American has really been taken for a ride. Kano coming up now to the bell. Wetton going... Very well in fourth place, the two Germans second and third. And Ryan closing all the time, but still 25 yards behind Kano. There's the bell, and Ryan's got to give him 25 yards start to catch him. Kano way in front. Tumor second, Norbert third. Wetton fading now, and Ryan going past Wetton. 300 yards left, the crowd going mad as Ryan tries to get back. Ryan in the down bend, accelerating all the time. And Ryan now taking the Germans. He's surely he's given him too much to do. Kano, 200 metres left. Ryan going into second place, but he can't hold it. And Kano will never be caught. The Kenyan, beaten in the 5,000 metres for speed, shows the world record holder the way home. And Ryan completely misjudged this. The Kenyans have beaten him tactically out of sight. Kano comes home way in front to take his gold medal. Second, Tim Ryan. Third, Bodo Tuna. Fourth, Harold Norbert. In fifth place, John Wetton. Sixth place, the Frenchman Boxberger. Seventh, Jordi Goffsky. Eighth, Odessil. And that time, just outside the world record for Kip Kano. And Jim Ryan really suffered tactically there and for having a whole series of slow races this season and which he's done all his running from the back.